Hi everyone, so I'm going to be doing a video today of one that I have seen on Twitter and Facebook and pretty much everywhere going around and I wanted to copy it and see if it actually works. So you've probably all seen it and it's this video where this girl has these really like plasticky, cheap looking eyelashes. She gets a spoolie, rubs them and they literally look like a £20 pair of eyelashes that are really fluffy and like the mink sort of looking ones. So I'm going to be doing that today with a pair of sort of eyelashes that I don't really like, they're not my favourites, see if we can get them looking a little bit better. So if you haven't seen the video, let me just show you which one I'm talking about. I'm sure you have, but this is the one where she makes like these plasticky looking eyelashes into amazing fluffy wispy looking ones. So yeah, basically I'm going to be trying it and see if it actually works. I don't know if you can see this very well here, I don't know if it's focusing, but yeah. You get the idea, and that's what I'm going to be trying out. To confirm, I am in my pyjamas. It's because I am um, just getting ready, and then I saw that video and just thought, you know what, I'm going to try that out. So I didn't bother getting changed, just kept it all natural. The two pairs I'm going to be using are these W7 ones. So I have these really full ones, which are really not me at all, so I haven't used them before. And these ones are like some more wispy sort of lashes. So I'm going to give them a go, see what happens. We'll do it on both the lashes, so we know the difference between what it does with what sort of lashes. These are the first pair and I've got my little spoolie which as you can see is filthy because I use it for my eyebrows. So let's go ahead and give one a good rub and see what happens. I'm going to be quite rough as well because they, they are rough in the video so let's see what happens. So this is the first pair and as you can see instantly how much more wispy they, wispier? Wispier they are. Like, look at that. I actually can't get over how much it has worked. That one looks really sort of plastic and straight. And that one just looks so wispy and something a lot more that I would wear. So definitely worked with them ones. So we'll give it a go on a little bit more of a natural lash. So these are the second pair. And again, I'm going to take my spoolie and go in and just start rubbing them. So I don't know if it's going to make that much difference with these ones because they are already wispy but we'll see we'll give it a go so again you can tell they are more wispy and they look sort of more 3d with more of sort of fluffiness at the edges rather than how straight these ones are so it has worked on both eyelashes i do think it has given a better effect on the other ones just because i think they were a bit more plasticky than these eyelashes were but look how much difference there is in those they are definitely a lot more fluffier on the ends and definitely a lash that I would wear. These ones I'm going to go ahead and do the other one and see the difference when we can do both of them together. I have it, that's it done on both lashes. Look how fluffy and wispy they are now. I can't actually get over how much that works because before they definitely were some eyelashes that I would wear. They're just not my style, but these ones may be a little bit too long, but they are quite dramatic, so maybe for a night out sort of lash, uh, they will need their ends trimming before I put them on because they are a little bit too wide for my eyes. But let's trim them down and put them on and see what they look like now that we've messed about with them. So I've just trimmed them down just to fit my eye and I'm going to pop my glue on and wait for them to go a little bit tacky. Um, by the way, this eyeliner that I'm wearing, I have run out of mine and I quickly got one from the pound shop. I know, right, pound shop. And it is absolute crap. Like, please don't waste your good English pound on this eyeliner. I bought it because I thought, oh, do you know what, I'm just going to quickly use it because I need one. Every time I use it, like when I run out of my normal one, I use this one and it like cracks. It cracks everywhere and it just looks shit. So apologies for the gross eyeliner, but I'm currently using the pound one because I've run out of my other one. I've just zoomed you in so you can see the gross eyeliner and my horrible spotty face, which I've broke out so bad recently. My skin's disgusting. But anyway, I'm going to apply the eyelashes and see what they look like. Like they were the hardest eyelashes to stick on ever like I feel like they're still not properly stuck on properly I think the band 
is obviously still very plasticky and hard because you don't give that a rub and night going to make a difference but yeah they were very hard to stick on you know on one side stick down and the other side just sticks up and every time you try to stick the other one down the other one flicks up well that's what they were doing these are probably the eyelashes that I would wear more on a night out rather than a day to day basis because they are so thick they are quite dramatic and with no eyeshadow on I think they look even more dramatic so they're still not ones that I would wear every day because they are a little bit dramatic for me. You know what? Overall, I am impressed. It's got rid of like the plasticky looking eyelashes. Definitely 100% made them more wispy and wearable. I'd definitely still wear these lashes, don't get me wrong. Obviously, just not in the daytime because they are very full and thick and fluttery. But thumbs up to whoever thought of doing that because, my God, you have just changed every girl's life who can't afford an expensive pair of eyelashes. Get yourself a horrible, plasticky looking pair, give them a rub, there you go, got your beautiful wispy eyelashes. So I can confirm to every girl that this trick does work and I give it a big thumbs up. Definitely try it, I didn't really believe it would work because you saw this sort of stuff on Twitter and viral videos and stuff don't usually work but it works and I'm so happy. Just zoom you in again just to have another close up of how much fluffy they are and what they looked like before. I just, I can't get over the difference of what they were and how they are now. If you have tried this trick and it worked for you, please let me know in the comment section down below. If you like these sort of videos, please give it a thumbs up and please remember to subscribe to my channel. My Instagram and Twitter will also be in the down bar if you do want to follow any of those and I will see you in my next video everyone. Bye!